everybody, this is 22 Tiger Dude here, and I am here to review Megan Levy. So, Megan Levy stars Kate Mara, Common, and Tom Felton. So, Megan Levy is based on a true story of this young woman named Megan Levy, and she doesn't really have the best relationship when it comes to her parents' role, really specifically her own mother, and she's not really a people person. She can't really interact with a person, so to make her life better, she does enlist in the military and it does lead her to have a military dog and so she partners up with this military dog named Rex as she is partnering up with this dog named Rex she realizes how much she actually cares and there's just something about this dog that really speaks to her more than any other human being out there. Megan Levy is a film I was actually very interested in. I did like the trailer that was showcased whenever I would go out to the movies. I just thought it looked like a very interesting film. Yes, did the trailer give you a little bit of a lifetime -y vibe? Sure it did, but I was still interested in Megan Levy nonetheless. And this is actually from the same director of this documentary called Blackfish. I actually actually have never seen this documentary but I have heard so many good things so it's really cool to see this director going from making a documentary to making a based on a true story movie like Megan Levy and honestly after seeing Megan Levy I was pretty blown away by this film I think this movie is truly fantastic first of all I gotta say that the script is very well written if you're worried that this is gonna be like a lifetime movie for me personally I really did not get that vibe this movie definitely is not lifetimey, from my point of view at least. It felt very grounded. It felt very realistic. I honestly think the script is great from Pamela Gray, Annie Momolo, and Tim Lovestit. I'm pretty sure I mispronounced that one, but th they honestly did a very good job of writing the script. They just made the dialogue feel so real. And so genuine. This director, I'm pretty sure I'm going to mispronounce the director that also directed Blackfish, Gabriella Cowperthwaite, honestly did a fantastic job directing this film. She really made this film feel so real. The screenplay itself already felt so real, but the way she was able to take you into such a harsh atmosphere, honestly, that's credit to her. She really did bring me into the story. Kate Mara is truly fantastic in this film. This might actually be the best I've seen Kate Mara. I really have to think about it, but you know, as far as the movies I've seen her in, I think this is Kate Mara at her best. She is truly fantastic. She gives such an emotional performance and Whenever you see her character wanting to break down because of how much she cares about this dog, you truly believe the emotion she feels, and that's credit to her. Speaking of the dog, honestly, Rex the dog, a uh, really great performance from this dog, honestly. This dog did a very terrific job. I think this dog honestly deserves as much credit acting-wise as Kate Mara as Megan Levy. They were both great in their performances. I truly believed their bond and that's the most important thing when you make a based on a true story movie. You really want to believe this bond between this dog and this young woman and that's definitely the case here. Common was really great in this film. I really liked what he added into his role. Uh, definitely the best I've seen Common in a while. Tom Felton is also really good here and he's not typecasted as a bad guy because you know I like Tom Felton when he does these small roles in movies but let's be honest he's been really typecasted to play these bad guys so to see him play a good role like being a good person in this film it honestly was a breath of fresh air and although Tom Felton is not in this film that much his role was very important. His role actually added a lot to the storyline and I cared about his character honestly and I don't want to really spoil too much but just following Megan Levy's story was very interesting and I actually really liked Megan Levy's father for whenever he's 
in the film, especially when he tries to cheer up Megan. The cinematography here is something I also admire about Megan Levy. I think it is beautifully shot. It is very professional in every framing, especially in this one war sequence. There is a war sequence in this film, and it is when Rex the dog tries to sniff for any bombs and then there is some shooting that goes on after that so this movie really just has one war sequence and it's a pretty lengthy one too it's like maybe 15 minutes at best if i were to predict but that whole entire sequence honestly had me at the edge of my seat i honestly was pretty speechless during that entire sequence my heart was actually pounding and I think that's just thanks to the performances and the execution the writing and just the overall direction I think it's because of all that it just really felt so real and I felt very scared in that moment now as far as problems do go with Megan Levy there really isn't that much but if I were to really just point out my criticisms for this film I will say that there is this romantic storyline with Megan Levy and this other sergeant and anytime the film would cut to that I would honestly just tell the film to just cut back to the scenes with her and Rex or the scenes with her and her mom because I, I think the conflict and how it was executed that was very interesting or whenever she's with her dad but anytime it did cut to her uh, interacting with the sergeant I didn't find it to be that interesting I did understand the point well obviously one is based on a true story but two it kind of wanted to show her being more interactive with someone else that is enlisted in the military so it definitely makes sense I just wish that part of the story was more engaging and really I do think that the movie does jump around in some scenes and it does feel rather rushed in some scenes as well when she enlists in the military we see her going through her training and I thought that was pretty rushed I get that they wanted to get to the point of like her meeting with Rex but I did feel like that they rushed her training and then there will be even maybe a moment where she goes back home after being out there with Rex but then she goes back home for like the holidays and the next minute she's already back there so uh, there's times where the way the film does jump around it does feel a little out of place to me and like I said sometimes it does come off as being a little bit rushed but over Overall, I think Megan Levy is truly a fantastic movie. It honestly had me pretty emotional. I did buy into this true story with Megan Levy and her dog Rex. I really bought into their bond. I think the screenplay is truly terrific. I truly did love Megan Levy. This is definitely one of the best films to come out in 2017. I'm going to give Megan Levy three and a half out of four stars. So you guys, in the comments down below, let me know, what did you think about Megan Levy? This is 20 to Tiger Dude here, and don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power!